You are listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional. Today's topic, Roy, from Reggae to Jesus, Part 2. One Friday night, actually it was early Saturday morning, Roy, a successful reggae DJ, left the club where he was working and went home to watch music videos on TV. It was something he did to unwind many Saturday mornings. I turned on BET, Black Entertainment Television, only to find an older white gentleman speaking. I almost changed the channel, but the things he said were so captivating that I found myself glued to the TV for the next 30 minutes. The speaker he listened to was a man named Joe Cruz. Roy watched him for several months and eventually mailed in to receive free Bible studies. I began learning so much about the Bible. I even tried to keep the Sabbath, but not very successfully. Sometime later, Roy continues, this new white guy comes on one Saturday morning. He explained that Joe Cruz passed away and that he was the new speaker for Amazing Facts. I was devastated, he admits. Who could possibly know the Bible like Joe Cruz? Roy confesses, I grew to like Pastor Doug Batchelor. He invited people to attend an evangelistic series called Net 97. I intended to go only one night to see this Doug live. I had no intention of becoming part of a church. He soon discovered that he would not personally hear Pastor Doug since this was a satellite program, but Bachelor's preaching was so captivating that I came every single night. On July 25, 1998, Roy was baptized into God's remnant church in Queens. He quit his job in the music business and never looked back. Roy became very active in church and was soon serving as a personal ministries leader, sharing his faith with others. Roy eventually became an elder in his church and also a director of youth for a church conference. Having been involved in the music entertainment field, Roy has a heart for youth interested in contemporary music. There's a lot of alluring and captivating music that sounds good, he warns, but the pictures they paint are not as beautiful as they might look on the surface. He encourages youth to go to the source of truth, the Bible. Roy shares, I can't thank God enough for amazing facts. It literally saved my life. Have you ever struggled to give up something in order to have Jesus? Is there anything more important than eternal life? Our key Bible text today comes from Matthew chapter 10 and verse 39. He that findeth his life shall lose it, and he that loseth his life for my sake shall find it. Thank you for listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional.